poses and then I will give you some time to practice it, okay? So the first thing, um, as you, you have that much restrictions in the back side, so what you do, you bring your both feet in front of you mm -hmm. and the sole of the feet is connected, mm -hmm. okay? Now, let's plug a little bit right up and down, okay? So, up and down. So, close, okay, to mark it. Whenever you're coming to me, Ayurveda, always keep something loose so that okay. uh, if we need to practice something or do something on that day, it will be easy for you. Okay. Right? Or keep with you, at least yeah. in the course. That you can do, right? Yes. Yeah. All right. So, up and down, up and down. This is called it as a Badrasana. So here, there are uh, many organs in this area, uh, many muscles in these areas, tiny muscles. Mm -hmm. They get worked on very nicely. So if you want, you can bring a little closer because it's very tough for you to do that in jeans, okay? Mm -hmm. But uh, just remember this, that you are slowly coming towards the, uh, closer to the body, okay. okay? As you come closer to the body, you will feel a little bit different work on the different muscles, mm -hmm. different muscles getting engaged. And once you are good, then you bring yourself open. Mm -hmm. And then you plug it. You support your hands. Uh, nice. The, the fingers are out mm -hmm. in the T. You are like almost like a T. And now do it. And now you feel the, the different engagement of the muscles. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this is very good. Keep your back straight. Lift higher. Good. And support your back like my elbows are supporting my uh, back okay and now you will be seeing this is what you must be feeling engagement all right mm -hmm. so this is the budrasana mm -hmm. or butterfly pose you can say butterfly pose yeah. okay now uh, in the second one if you can come here and bring this a little forward inhale here look up to you know and slowly well, along with the breathe out, you come down. Slowly inhale up. Reach up. Lift your heart, chest. Exhale down. Inhale. Exhale, lead with your heart. So the very important thing for this, uh, dear, is you do all these asanas. Uh, these are all a little bit intense asanas, advanced asanas. So you do this once you are done with the sun salutation. Because in the sun salutation, the body warms up nicely. Now my body is not also warmed up, right? But I'm trying to teach you. Mm -hmm. So if, if, if you do the sun salutation, then it's easy for the body to reach and connect and, you know, open up or do it with, uh, with the flexibility. As if this is not opened up and we are directly hitting the asana, it's a little bit challenge, okay? Yeah. All right? So inhale up and exhale down. But if your breath is out here, just stay here. Just stay here. You don't have to reach if once the breath is out. Oh. So wherever it is out, just stay there. Enjoy that flow right there. Okay. And release. So this is the second one. Mm -hmm. The third one, and what I want you to do, this is a butterfly bringing the nose to the feet. Uh, I think that posture must be here somewhere. Hold on. And now on the page 12. Page 12. So we are talking about the Mahamudra with the Paschimottasana asana, one leg Paschimottasana asana. So page 12. Okay, that one. Put your name in front of it. Okay. Because there's 
husband and you both are sharing the books. So, okay. That was 48, I believe. So, uh, yeah, 48. Okay. So now bring your both legs forward in front of you. You are like a T. Hmm? Okay. Now, right leg, bench, and bring your heel close to the groin area. So slowly, inhale. Bring your left arm up. Left leg is forward, right? This is the left leg. This is the left hand. Mm -hmm. Exhale and try to reach. Reach. Beautiful. And here, feel it. Okay? Feel into your thigh. Feel into your muscles. Now, bring your right arm up. Inhale. Look up. And exhale and grab your reach. Look up. Now try to bring your knee, nose to the knee. Now look, look forward towards your knees. Grab your both hands. Inhale here. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, now once you are here, inhale, just do inhale and exhale right here. And you see, feeling is very important. And that much restrictions we have. I want you to observe your body. Okay? Very good. You understood this? Okay. The same, we will repeat on the other side of the body. Okay? So, I will give you five minutes. Practice the first one. Do everything like 15 times dynamic, dynamic moment. Not the flow moment because I expect something different from you. So, first try just do the slow flow once you're good and comfortable and uh, okay i can do this now so stay in the that um, pose hold that pose and then just do the dynamic movement like right mm -hmm. that okay? okay so that uh, uh generally for what the person like your husband i teach differently mm -hmm. but you're exactly a little bit opposite to him mm -hmm. so i'll be teaching you differently okay okay make sense yeah okay so the, the same, we will repeat it from the other side of the foot. So you will continue this, start from here, this and this, in and out. Mm -hmm. Okay, then you bring this, reach, again out. Yeah. And then once you are here, mm -hmm. turn, then in and out, then dynamic. Okay, so all of this, uh, do it for 5-10 minutes. I will get your table ready for you. Okay. And then I will teach you the breathing technique. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. So this is very important for you to open up your lower energies and this is all very important for you to observe your own body the restrictions in your body the tightness the stiffness mm -hmm. and uh, the the movement the flow whether it is easy for you or hard for you like that okay